cutting potatoes in cubes? It's now easy with the new Pro Cuber and Fry Cutter from Starfrit. In two easy steps, quickly obtain perfect cubes. Great also for onions, carrots, cucumber, and ham. Cutting fries in sticks? Easy, takes only one step. And you only need to press down to get slices. A real three in one. Stable, efficient, and easy to use. The new Pro Cuber and Fry Cutter. Another innovation from Starfrit. This tutorial will guide you through the usage of the milk system of your Latissima 1 machine. To start, fill the milk container up to one of the two levels indicators, cappuccino or latte macchiato. Close the milk container and connect the rapid cappuccino system to the machine. The machine heats up for approximately 15 seconds. Lift the lever completely and insert the capsule. Then close the lever. Place a cappuccino cup or a latte macchiato glass under the coffee outlet. Adjust the milk spout position by lifting it up to the right level. Press the milk button. The preparation starts after a few seconds. The milk will pour first and will stop when the milk container is empty. The coffee will pour next. When your preparation is finished, lift and close the lever to eject the capsule into the used capsule container. At the end of the preparation, the clean alert illuminates orange to indicate it is necessary to clean the rapid cappuccino system. Disassemble the rapid cappuccino system and clean all components in the upper side of your dishwasher. To disassemble your rapid cappuccino system, proceed as follows. Remove the milk container by pressing the button on the side of the milk jug. Unplug the aspiration tube. Press the button on the side of the milk jug to pull out the milk spout. Press the button on the side of the milk jug and pull to unlock the rapid system connector. If you do not have a dishwasher, soak all components in hot potable water at approximately 40 degrees centigrade or 104 degrees Fahrenheit together with mild soft detergent for at least 30 minutes and rinse thoroughly with potable water. Then dry all parts with a fresh and clean towel, cloth or paper and reassemble. Thank you for watching this tutorial.